Hi everybody, it's me, back at Champion Ford, reviewing the Ford F-150 STX. Now, this is one of your lower models, not like the best model they sell or anything. So, first let's get into the interior. Alright, so starting off, I haven't even the interior. We got this display right here. Now, I think Ford put a lot of detail into that. Um, so, you got a pretty nice touch screen here. I'm, I'm pretty surprised, but Ford's putting out like these huge iPads or something. Like, almost like Tesla. Alright, so you don't have any C controls down here. You just have a lever. And then the glove box, it's pretty decent. It's pretty decent. You could take this tray off. Yeah. All right. So moving on into the back of the car here. Second row seats. Okay, so right when I get in here, I don't actually see too much light. This is, I'm actually really surprised. You've got a lot of headroom, but where's all your leg room? I don't even know anymore. What is Ford doing with the cars? Um, yeah, you don't, like, you don't have any seats back there, but I'm expecting that because, well, I mean, this is a lower model. You have chargers down here. It's somewhere down there. But, yeah, you have a Type-C charger and just a regular USB. All right, now moving on to the very, very back of the car. Um, Now, I wouldn't need this much room because I don't even drive a car yet. I'm only like 11. Um, but this is a very, very long range of room. That's something like if you work somewhere like, like you're building stuff, something like that would actually be really handy. Have a backup camera there. That works pretty well there. Um, Next, your rims. Now, these are some pretty decent looking rims that you might care about rims, but I don't care about rims too much. Um, I don't know. All right, so next, you get like this side thing here that Ford has because of the STX model. Right in here is like a grill leading to the engine. And here's your huge antenna. I mean, I know why it's there, but yeah. Then you got these huge ginormous lights that nobody needs. And then this grill isn't too bad. I would rate this car, so on a rating of 10 um, to zero, I would rate this car about a seven. Um, yeah, so I mean, I don't know. I think I, I think it's it's for pulling out trees. I don't know. Yeah. Also, if you, if your friend's car is stuck and they got some huge ram or something, uh, that would be handy. All right. So I think that's the end of our, my review here. I mean, there's not too much about this car. If you're trying to look for a not so expensive car. Go pick this up. This car is about forty-five thousand. Yeah, so it's a pretty decent price. I hope you enjoyed my review. Go check out Champion Ford and Erie PA. Bye.